second battle of the day, it is the Don't Flop 6 annual birthday event. It's been fucking crazy. This is the second battle of the day. Massive shouts to Peace Soldier and Pedro for starting off the day in absolute great style. This is battle number two, it is day number one. I'm gonna straight into the battle, straight away immediately. I cannot wait to introduce the MC on my right hand side. He last battled over two years ago, the fourth birthday, RIP Cable, man, shouts to them. But making his return here in Stylus, please make him feel welcome, the Calcium King and Everyone who asked me to shout them out and I forgot about it. Shout them out. Shout out to Kelsey, who likes him. It's fourth Jazz birthday, he likes Loud, and he's now come back. This is going to be an amazing UK battle. And the UK MC on my left hand side, absolutely smashed it in knots on four days prep. Shouts for that. But now, here at the sixth birthday, please make some fucking noise for Pamphlet! And hey, shout out to uh, EA Podcast on SoundCloud and OSW Review on YouTube. Check them out. So. Alright, I forgot again who's first. Me. All right, cool. All right, here's uh, non-judge things as usual in the uh, end board at the screen when it says please vote for anything. Well, please take five seconds to vote on our official website for you to vote for. All right, it's on pamphlet round number one. Let's go. I'm coming hot. <laughs> <laughs> this cunt is not his puppy cock. You shut your eyes and suck on your lollipop and imagine it's your buddy's cock. <laughs> so it's Taylor Adams versus Jason Knife Hands. It's Tony D's favourite white man versus a Baby Spice fan. <laughs> you, need, you need to take your life back, cos blazing pipes made from Sprite cans got your crazy mind jacked like David Icke has. <laughs> I'ma make this guy sad, cos I spit it darker than a Katie Price tan. <laughs> I move gas, I'm afraid I'm a farter. <laughs> You move gas with your mate in a garden, hiding, whistling, filming for Facebook and laughing while you're saying, Where are you? Where are you? I can't see you. Where are you? I spit it greater and bring the flavour. <laughs> on a pen and paper elevating on a bed of nails whilst penetrating Cheryl Baker on record breakers. <laughs> Your mother's knicker vapours are chicken flavoured. <laughs> that silly bitch was listed in a business bit of the yellow pages as a fetish slave who literally licked the shit from a dripping anus for a cigarette and a bit of paper. <laughs> She once did Blizzard a little favour and give him anal in exchange for a spliff and a sip of Jaeger. <laughs> How come you're Joanna Lumley's size but you have a mum that's white? <laughs> She's so fat and dumb that I call her Apple Crumble Fight. <laughs> Hear me rhyme good and she's a really nice woman. But she's so weirdly white her skin's clearly quite looking like a creamy rice pudding. <laughs> Your ma I give your I made your mum sick when she licked my medicine balls. <laughs> you, you can't blame me, definitely though, because she once did every member of your secondary school in the assembly hall. <laughs> you get a hard on fast whenever dance mum starts. <laughs> Believe that shit. This geezer's sick, he's a prick. I don't know if you've seen the story, but it's recent and it seems legit. People's kids have been playing with this thing called the evil stick. And it's his penis tip. <laughs> Yo. An ode to Pamphlet's inability of imagery. You look like a snowman that's been socked in the eye with a lack of creativity. Yo. Yo. I refute chasing the word respect around a circus tent. I circumvent. I'm only this skinny because I spend my time kicking the fucking earth to death. Yo. Yo. <laughs> Yo, cry me a motherfucking bucket of tears about how you struggle to get love from your peers. I'm only here because I haven't killed a hooker in years. <laughs> Oh, Pammy, why did you start? Pretty please lie me a farce. You hit a mile and a half shy of the mark. This battle is watching beige paint dry in the dark. I'm only here because I'm only here because dog walkers make it exceedingly difficult to cry in the park. <laughs> Yo. 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 I'm on 
on that Sam Seed's rubber legs quicker than a bookie's pen. Oh, don't you love it when your style is a dozen eggs smothered from a mother hen. I stay poignant as something Danny Glover said. <laughs> I'll smother this hooker dead with a slice of buttered bread. <laughs> Yo. Stick to framing stamps and emailing Bret Hart your favourite chants. <laughs> I will show up at your door with 10,000 trailing ants, waving shanks, threatening your neighbour's plants, demanding to be paid advance. <laughs> Bitch, I fight like a 1984 Kevin Bacon dance. <laughs> no, I will fucking, I will kung fu your front two for footloose, like fuck you, Kevin Bacon bars. <laughs> yo, <laughs> yo, dare me to snap. I will bitch slap you in front of a glare in a cat as they glare at your back with 11 magpies on a line purged to attack. <laughs> Yo, your style is cold porridge for the mother bear. Remember when you left and nobody fucking cared? <laughs> no, the, diff Yo, uh, the difference between me is, the difference between me and you is, you use Barbie scissors to cut your hair. I turn the gas on and struck a flare. Everything I buy from Ikea, I turn into a wooden chair. <laughs> Fuck this dirty skirt, my words are best. <laughs> referencing, <laughs> referencing something in that verse you said you were going to kick the earth to death, but you can't because I got there first and now no turf is left. <laughs> Eating. He's bisexual because he had gammon this evening and he's a vegan. <laughs> you ain't go ham or the sandwich of beef in Jacob's crackers, and I actually believe him because you look like Tams in that actress from Green Wing got packed with a snatch for the semen after shagging a cheese strip. Get a cheese strip for cheese thin. <laughs> I spit great puns. You're a thin lame cunt. You ain't Big J's son, you look like Big J's son. <laughs> the other day I saw Posh and Bex having sex within the loose. I say loose because I saw Rebecca with them too. <laughs> now I know you need to go and eat a belly full of food because I've seen Victoria Beckham in a nude. And even the silicone that she went to get removed from her little set of boobs is heavier than you. <laughs> I feel I need to carve you a steak that's like half of your weight and even still it wouldn't fill the middle part of my plate I should fart in your face but I can't because my target's off Your bars are soft Your bars are soft There's no way that you'll palm me off because you look like you went to the barber shop and asked for the Charlie Sloth <laughs> This past is lot like a gnarly rocker who became old. This party pop is just a lame joke. You look like Jarvis Cocker and your brain's pulp. I don't need to bring a gun in his son. I let the words kill him, yo. I leave calcium missing, which is ironic if the nerds didn't know, because you look like the milk carton from that blur video. <laughs> and I'm coming in hot. His mum is a dog. He's from the same place as the Beatles, but not the ones discovering part actual Beatles, because he lives <laughs> under a lock. <laughs> Time. Um, yo. Oh, wouldn't it be dope if I would oh so contrived, hoped you died. So do let's. Your style is yesterday's fish stock, repackaged and shipped off and preheated in your local chip shops on rinsed pots. <laughs> and what Hitchcock would think of if he sniffed rock the size of a quick drop from the brink of a cliff top. Do <laughs> you think Brick Top gets his fucking pigs off? <laughs> <laughs> I'm on that handwritten, nan knitted mitten box. Bitch, get to kicking rocks. Uh, you smoke weed, bruv. I smoke sniffer dogs. <laughs> <laughs> if I didn't have to be here, I could be in the tree line licking frogs trying to raise 1.21 gigawatts. <laughs> Yo, I like to ride my bicycle a lot, sipping liquor with schnapps, trying to nickel your pogs with my motherfucking dick in a box. <laughs> Yo, I'm on that. Fucking white rabbit, hot water combo, bow tie, quan do. Mm. Balloon animal jujitsu first dan. On my third can, I'll eat you with four dab hands and a work fan. Ah. Yo, 
My name bless my cotton socks. I'm not scared, fam. <laughs> <laughs> you look like you listen to bed, man. That's it. No, no, it's not. Yo, yo, no, it's not. Yo, um, yo. You have far too much of a vagina to stop me. I will run you over while drunk driving the designated driver, the offy. Yo. Yo. Yo, with no feet. I'll fucking smother this coast guard with a postcard of his own beach. Yo, remember when you said you didn't care if you made stacks as long as they clapped? That's a gay fact. <laughs> you, you rhymed poo and loo. Suffice it to say, some things you just can't take back. <laughs> yo. <laughs> yo. Um, yeah, um, yeah, you dick in a box. <laughs> yeah! Woo! Yeah! You wanted to battle daylight. <laughs> you wanted to battle daylight on some tight pant tip because you're gay but you're straight sick of white man's dick. <laughs> so you asked if they could make him come and fly back quick because you knew that he'd get naked and you like that shit. <laughs> you wanted to be the first rapper on Don't Flops, it's most prob to go down on one knee on the stage but he won't cause you didn't want to propose dog, you wanted to give him a blowjob. <laughs> you wanted to come in midday. <laughs> like a sofa from DFS. <laughs> he once went to the deed of a yo do for a piece of meth and tried to buy coke with a VHS he'd just stolen from BHS. VHS. <laughs> <laughs> Stop lying about the girls you've had sex with. <laughs> he claims he's had so many babies. <laughs> He reckons he's had so many babes off of Baywatch, he's basically Dave Hoff. <laughs> Your rate of the weight loss is greater than Kate Moss, whereas I keep getting bigger every day I'm awake cause I see that bread like the Great British Bake Off or Tony Gray in a cake shop. <laughs> it's like when you was born, God mixed up your arse and head. <laughs> this scouse has passed his best. He's like Dougal from Father Ted if he starred instead in a cast of bread. <laughs> I was originally supposed to be battling soul at this mad event, but you stole his roll and his bread like you was jacking Jed at a uh, Greg's. <laughs> I didn't think that would have effect, I just wanted to star in bad bars with Buddy Bagnall next. <laughs> yeah! Bagnall's the fella. His cameras are better. They'll focus the fuck out, cha cha. Better be packing the cheddar pamphlet, it's clever. Cause I just wrote a load of dough jokes and told them sandwiched together. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I promised myself if you use the term rapping it great in this battle today, I would throw you at a grenade. <laughs> no. No. This matchup is a motherfucking slap in the face. We can fight, cause to me hospitals a free sandwich and a packet of grapes. Sorry, I mug you for an apple a day. Yo, who's back to his best? Who's phoning up the NHS and asking for sex? Who's cashing in checks to take whose ex-girlfriend's cats to the vets? Me? Yo. 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 Yo, I'm sick of these motherfuckers that try to act crazy. I am crazy as cat ladies trying to contract rabies. You look like Pat Swayze, he's a legitimate crack baby. I stay slick as my nan's gravy. Pam, say me, you're samey as ever. You look like Wham had a motherfucking baby together. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'll force this lady a leisure to make me a sweater. I'll visit your local golf course and hassle staff till they make me a member. Steal the eight hole and make my nan's garden a half acre the better. Oh. Kill yourself and save me the pleasure of grating pepper in your open wounds. I'll show up at you. I'll. Yo, I'll make it in your local news for stealing soup with a loaded spoon. Yo. Yo, I'll stab you during a game of snooker and claim I didn't know the rules. <laughs> Kill a baroness for a motherfucking chauffeur's shoes. Yo, yo. <laughs> who delivers the Henry Janaski? And who looks like motherfucking Kelly Kapowski? <laughs> you do. You do. Die in a fire. Die in a fire. <laughs>
kind of venue because I've missed out on it for the last like three years really, big venues like this and feeling confident with my lyrics so big seeing the progress is like it's amazing really long mate.